Hello, welcome to my channel. I thought to start off with the Sunless Sea. So let's start a new game. Yes. So this game is set in the Untersea, the same universe as Fell Better Games' other game, which is Fallen London, a browser based choose your own adventure, I think. Which is meant to be rather good. So, anyway, here we are at the start. So we choose a past. So who do you want to be? Let's see, you now lodge in a room above the blind's helmsman. So, do I want to be a street urchin, a poet, a veteran of the campaign of 68, whatever that is, oh, an invasion of hell, an ordained priest or natural philosopher? So these all give you benefits. So I think I'll be a natural philosopher, which gives you a bonus to mirrors, which is a skill of detection and perception. Or maybe actually a street urchin. I think veils is what gives is the better the veils you have, the less likely you are to be detected. Which for my for single playthrough seems to be quite a good idea. So let's go with that. So no cunning on the high seas, your friend, another long shanks knows a little gunnery and your little talk to her to find out why she went to sea. So we just gain these by choosing to be a street urchin. <laughs> So we have 10 Echo, which is the currency. We've got 25 extra veils, which is the skill of basically evasion. And we have a Long Shanks Gunner, which will be part of our crew up here. So she's got I on one, which, let's see, right click, doesn't want to. Let's finish this first. Right, choose an ambition. <coughs> so, your father's bones. Find him and return his remains to London. Fulfillment, gather lots of tales, wealth, obviously, a private kingdom, establish a colony, mm, possibly not. Well, I can't choose it anyway. So, basically, things open up as you get further into the game. So, after you die and restart, this possibly, if you found it, would be an option. So, basically, this game has a legacy system. So, when you die things carry over to your next character. I'm not sure what, as I hasn't, haven't done it yet. So that's fulfilment, that's gather tales. So this seems to be a rather important part of the game. So, whenever you return to Fallen London, you have your option of retiring, but first you need to write your masterwork. Jolly good. So, Captain, Captain, what do they wish to address you as? Let's go with Captain. Be original. So, here we are. A last piece of advice explore, take chances. Mm, explore, yes, take chances. Maybe not. So, let's choose. Let's have that. Name Caliban. And off we go. So, this is the basic port screen. So we have the story, which gives you the options where you can find your stories and what to do. A hold, which obviously is your ship, your weapons, etc., your cargo. Curiosities are sort of things you can sell to certain people, I think, generally. Journal, officers, say we've got, we can speak to her, the Longshanks Gunner. So if you gather a secret from somewhere, you can use that to improve her, her skills, which is iron. So I'm not sure what iron does. I mean, it's something to do with direct damage. So let's go back. So and the shops in this port, well, there's quite a few shops, which is quite good. They're not too bad prices. So we've got the visions, it's basically ship lights. We have various guns and things here and there. Now we've got provision provisioners which have supplies and fuel which are very important. And various other things for sale and this is engines. All extremely expensive. Now the ship's class you have oh have different ones last time. So we have Tigerish. These are other ships you can buy all pretty expensive apart from this basic one which I don't think you really want 
So let's go back to the story. Advice for captains. So here's basically a, the manual which tells you what happens, what to do. So da -da, ba -da -ba -da -da. Exploration, exploration is the heart of the game. So basically you just have to go to the various docks, talk to the people, make reports, gather secrets, then report back here to the Admiralty and they'll give you money for the reports, which seems to be the best way, of, the main way of making money. So when you're out, out at sea you gain terror, which is this here. Eventually if you fill up this bar, I'm not sure what happens, but nothing good I expect. So on new stories you'll find stories, these can be sold or used when you complete them, I think. And you can sell this book, so you require no more advice. Yeah, because that's worth it, I think. Unless it gets updated, which I don't think it does, which would be very annoying, but continue. So London, visit the Admiralty. Well, we don't really need to at the moment, so we haven't got anything really to do. No, no. Enough of the minutes. Lodgings. So this will gain you various things. If you rest in the room, but we can't do yet. So read the morning papers. So well, you can occasionally find useful bits here. So we've gained one supply, which goes up to here. We now have six, which isn't a lot, and ten fuel, which is sufficient for now. So let's go to the shops. It's probably best to buy some more supplies. So let's just buy let's buy ten of those. That'll do. And so it's time to depart. So here's your ship. Down here. It's basically the controls for it, apart from the movement keys. So here we have the Z-Bat, which is basically, it'll tell you if there's any islands or interesting places near. These are the lights. So if you keep the lights on, your terror decreases quite slowly when you're out in the open seas. If you turn them off, it increases far more rapidly. But of course, if your lights are on, other things can see you, which is not good. So here we have repair, and this is full power to engines, which allows you to go faster, which is quite handy, but it can cause your engines to blow up and reduce your number of crew, which are up here. So let's launch, and off we go. So that's lovely aesthetic, very steampunky. So let's, I think it's best just to go in a straight line from here. So let's start sending out the Z-Bat. And Hunter's Keep is to the northeast. So let's go there. So you can see here you, your supplies are, will be gradually used up. And here is Hunter's Keep. Let's see if we can visit. Right, so these things here and this round circle of light is where you go to dock. If there's no round circle, then I don't think it's possible to dock. Most places seem to have docks, but there are a few islands and places which you'll find which you can't land on. So let's head into here. And we proceed to dock, which will stop you. Now we go to story first. Hunter's Keep. A hump of dark rocked, swathed in mist. So, you you will then get these options. Let's present yourself at the house. Yes. So, we have three sisters. Quite happy to see us at the moment. So, so we have an option to have lunch with each of the sisters. Or shall we look around the island? Let's have a look around the island first. So we, now by looking around we've got a port report, which we can send, give back to the Admiralty for some echo. So let's continue. Let's 
This seems a good thing. Luncheon. Lost 48 hunger. Acquainted. Not sure what that means. A tale of terror, which is another thing you can basically sell to somebody. I'm not sure what that is. Gained one supply, so that's quite good. So let's do it again. Not receiving visitors. No. Well, let's do. So let's see. News, news. So we have news which we can give to them, which means they'll see us. It's now been used up. And now we've been invited back to lunch with another sister. So let's go with Phoebe. So she's told us a story. We've lost one terror. Gained another quality, another supply. We have one memory, which I assume again you can sell, basically sell to somebody. And I think that's all we need to do here. So let's depart. So see down here it's fragments. So everything you discover basically fills this bar. Once this bar is filled you gain a secret which can be used to buy or talk to people. You can sell them to some people for various items or you can speak to your crew for example to increase your iron, increase that stat of that crew member you can spend a secret, which we can't do yet. So, we'll leave it there for today, and we will carry on another time. So, thank you all, and goodbye.